All right, so we're back for our oily chat this week, talking about our favorite products. Um, who wants to start? I vote Luke goes first. Okay. <laughs> um, I have been relearning my love for the wood line of oils, like the balsam fir and the evergreen, and I just, I love that. I've been doing a little more woodworking out in the garage. We've been getting stuff kind of cleaned out and doing some of that while we're still at the house. And um, I just, I love those scents. So I don't, I don't know about the health. I don't know any of that side of things, but they just smell great. I like, I like the way they smell. I enjoy them. I had to reorder um, Northern Lights Black Spruce because oh, yeah. I love that one. My favorite. Mm -hmm. That, that one in awesome. Juniper. I like those two wood ones. Mm -hmm. Cedar wood, of course. Christmas I love because we have a fake tree. So I put, I open the evergreen and like throw it at the tree. Oh yeah. <laughs> I was like, yeah. <laughs> I don't have all the mess of the pine needles and crap, but I still get that nice smell. So. <laughs> Good idea. This, this weekend, John and I were walking a property we were interested in in northern Wisconsin, and the mosquitoes were like horrible by the road. And this property was on a lake, and it had cedars all along the lake shore. And when you got in by the cedars, there were no mosquitoes in there. Mm. And so I thought how interesting that we have cedar wood oil and I never, and then people make like cedar side, a natural insect repellent for like your lawn. And I thought, well, that's interesting. I bet you I could use cedar wood to help repel mosquitoes. Yeah. And then to see it in action was pretty cool to know that that's what we have in our bottle. Cool. Hmm. That's awesome. Very Nature cool. is so cool. I know. It's awesome. <laughs> Well, I've been diffusing a lot of motivation this week. Oh. I kind of, from time to time, I'm, I just kind of like get in my own little, I'm like, all right, I really need to get some stuff done. And so I've been actually diffusing this for a few days. So tonight when I got home from, from work, you know, had dinner, um, then I was like, okay, I gotta get some stuff done. So mowed the grass, took the dog for a walk, made some cookies, you know, I'm just like, poop, 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 poop. <laughs> so I really love, I love the smell of it too. It's just like, oh, this is so great. Um, very uplifting and just, mm -hmm. but I do like, I do like the woodsy sense that um, Luke, you were talking about too. I'm, I'm all about those. I'm like, ooh, mm -hmm. Northern Lights is like one of my absolute oh, favorites. Yeah. And I usually put orange with it. Mm. I haven't tried that. Mm -hmm. That would be good. It's very nice. <laughs> well, I know what I'm diffusing tomorrow. <laughs> What's um, your favorite? I... Sarah. Sarah. Sarah is your favorite? Why do you like Sarah? Uh -oh. You just like how it smells? Mm -hmm. What do you put <laughs> on your forehead at bedtime? Sacred angel. Sacred angel. Mm -hmm. Yep. Does it help you sleep? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we've been having a little bit of belly ache issues lately. So mm -hmm. what do we put on your belly? Tummy. Tummy jays and a rice pack. I'm telling you, for kids, does wonders. Tummy jays and a rice pack. A warm <laughs> rice pack. Bam. Done. Is it the rice pack I made for her? No, it's a different one. I have a bigger one. I have a bigger one that a friend gave me. So she likes it because, well, mom's and it's bigger. Nice. But well, I don't know where my rice pack is. Your rice pack actually went through the washer by accident. So <laughs> you know I guess what, I should make you a new one. <laughs> you know what happens to rice when it gets wet? Yeah. <laughs> That's what happened. Right? <laughs> well, uh, mine for the week actually isn't an oil or a Young Living product. It's an interesting side benefit. And it's the oily fireside chats because um, anyone watching the replay will notice that this video will be short and late um, because we spent the first 25 minutes just chatting together and supporting each other as sisters for our businesses and like um, how we're struggling with educating people when we can't do in person classes. And so we just spent the first 25 minutes giving each other ideas and encouraging each other and hey I'm struggling with this can you help me with that and um, since Rose came up with this ingenious idea of doing oily fireside chats on Tuesday nights it's something I really really look forward to because we get 
I mean, like as moms, as wives, as women, um, as social distance individuals, we get to come together and it's my once a week appointment, my meeting, my get together that I really look forward to because I get personal encouragement and I get that socialization despite the distance and I get support and encouragement with my business, which is what I'm using to support my family. So I just love the side benefit of the relationship that's come through Young Living and these oily fireside chats have been such an improvement in my life and I hope we keep them going, please, even after the <laughs> COVID thing is done. I know. I was thinking the I, same I think thing. we will. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think we will. I think it's, I think it's a great asset to our businesses. Mm -hmm. Um, and you know, cause it is, it's all about building each other up, um, helping each other grow in your business and advance. And, um, so I think, I think it needs to stay. <laughs> well, and in each other's health too. I mean, we were giving each other, I'm struggling with this. Like, what do you use? Cause just because we teach classes doesn't mean we know everything. Like I certainly don't know everything. So it's right. helpful to have other teachers to help teach the teacher. So I love these, these are fantastic. They help me get every drop out of my investment because yeah. I learned what to do with different oils. So I love that. Awesome. I think we only have about five minutes, so I'm just going to squeeze in mine really quick, although it's going to be really hard to top Tessa's because that really is the best part about all yeah. of our weekly tips. But without um, the oils and products, we wouldn't have anything to get together true. with. So my that's not true. the best. It's just a side benefit. <laughs> that's true. Um, so summer has started, and uh, John and I love to be outdoors, and especially on our boat fishing. Um, and so I've gotten a little bit more sun than usual, and I'm really enjoying my nice tan that my burn has turned into which by the way is more beautiful than it's ever been because i'm using young living products and the oils are so good for my skin but i wanted to talk about the hydrosol the royal hawaiian sandalwood hydrosol it's super super moisturizing um when i put it on i just feel like my skin is more radiant and it has like that kind of natural glow to it. I also have been using it after I'm shaving my legs um, for soft skin that way, which is also really, really nice um, yeah. in the summer. And it smells woodsy. So we were just talking about kind of the earthy woodsy scent. So I really like that. My one wish is that Young Living would come up with a rose hydrosol because um, I know someone who makes that and it smells so wonderful. If they come up with the rose, the two together will be spot on. But this well, alone is awesome. The international convention happened. You never know what they might release. I know, no. I'm hoping. <laughs> It'd be awesome. That would be a dream come true for me. <clears throat> it's it's going to be. It's gonna be awesome. Are we all going? Are are all of us international going yeah. Yeah. online? We have to if anybody hits the replay and is listening and you want to join in on the convention fun, you have until the fifth yeah. at eleven fifty nine Mount Time to register and vacation on all the different products. You are you'll be for access to the new products so um last year i was it last year yeah last year i did not do any i didn't go to convention um one option i don't even remember if they I did or not for like the two general sessions you could register yeah online. yeah i think too but um but then i had to wait like i think until the following month at least in order to before I could order the new release products. So mm -hmm. if nothing else, you get first in line to the new release products plus a bunch of yeah. education. Mm -hmm. um, so that's phenomenal. It's it's really good. I mean, I, I'm looking forward to what the you know how the virtual convention is going to be. But I'll tell you what, if you can ever, 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 and we need to plan this, ladies, by the way, mm -hmm. um, we all need to go to convention. Um, you will 
be just blown away um, by how how awesome it is and the farm and see how things are diffused, you know, distilled and it's it's really educational. Well, I'm excited for my first convention. Even if it's virtual, I'm excited. <laughs> Awesome. I will start saving pennies for the in-person one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we have like two yep, minutes left, yep. so we probably should wrap up so our recording doesn't get cut off. Um, anyone else have anything to add? Otherwise, we'll call her a night. We could just post the link maybe to convention when we do the oh, replay. Yeah, that's a good idea. Anybody oh, yeah. else, if anybody wants to check it out yep. when they're listening to the replay, we could do that. Yep. And then I'll post the link to the oil shelf that we talked about. Awesome. Yes. yes. That'd be awesome. Yeah. All, all right. right. Have a well, good, good night. See you all again. Have a good night. You see you later. Good seeing you. Bye. Bye. Bye.